The Cynic 30 is the flagship backpack in the Tom Bin lineup, behind only the ever-favorite Synapse 25. Since it was released, it's been a popular alternative to the Synapse as an EDC and a travel bag, but a challenger has emerged in the Tekonaut, and the gauntlet has been thrown. Both bags feature lots of pockets for hiding various things, but the Cynic definitely has the organizational edge over the Tekonaut, if that's your thing. Let's look at the back of both bags now. The Tekonaut has the new skeleton back panel first found on the Shadow Guide, and that adds structure and makes carrying it as a backpack more comfortable. Both bags have edgeless backpack straps, which to me are essential if you load bags like these to the gills. They also have the nice top handle and, most importantly for me, a dedicated laptop compartment. I love this thing. Both bags have a spacious main compartment, with the Cynic being able to open up all the way clamshell style. I've owned a Cynic for two years, and while I loved it initially, the honeymoon phase is over, and I've come to feel that the Cynic is a great bag with a bit of an identity crisis. For me, it's personally just a tad too big to be a good EDC bag, yet its shape doesn't work well for me as a travel bag. Don't get me wrong, I've taken this thing overseas several times, and it served me well, but it's mostly a piece in my collection now. Enter the Tekonaut. As a travel bag, I feel like the Tekonaut is the best of all worlds. It has the same edgeless straps that the Cynic has, plus you can also carry it with a shoulder strap if you like. I also like that the square-shaped body and minimal pockets fits my travel needs better than the Cynic. Take a look at the loadout I used in my previous video. Four shirts, two jeans in the packing cube, underwear and socks in the laundry stuff sack, my handy little thing, and my spiff kit. They all go in the Cynic just fine, but the Cynic's oblong eye drop shape makes the pack out feel a bit weirder. The load feels much more evenly distributed inside of the Tekonaut and also just looks nicer, though I I'm definitely a function over form kind of guy, so that doesn't matter as much to me. And most importantly, the Tekonaut has a dedicated laptop compartment, which is perfect for me and was a huge missing feature for me in the Aeronaut. If you want the versatility of a bag that chameleons well as an EDC or a travel bag, I think the Cynic 30 is still an amazing buy. It just has a ton of great features that make it a great all-around bag. I've come to prefer the Synapse with bound straps as an EDC, but still appreciate some of the great innovative features that were born from the Cynic. That said, I think the Tekonaut will be my permanent one-bag replacement for the Cynic when I travel. It just has everything I need in exactly the way I want it.